Good evening everyone, my name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video where today I am going to be right off the bat just running as fast as I can to try and find a spookwood tree. Uh, it has been a while. We found one, what, two weeks ago? And I have not been searching since, so I know. <clears throat> Are we loading? Is it loaded in? There we go. Oh no, I did it again. I did this last time. It fell right off. All right, we got an ax on us, so we're good. Uh, we need to jump up here to the top and start searching. So it is October, everyone. That means spookwood season is upon us. And I have seen images of dual spook trees in a session or in a uh, server. No way, is that, is it? Is that right there? That is. Nope, that's a dead tree. It died. It just now died. It's gone. Dang it. All right. Here's something else that I noticed. Um, I play Roblox in first person a lot, and I really like it. Something else I really like is the VR for um, Oaklands. I don't know. I Actually, I do know. I know that I don't like how... I treated Oaklands whenever I first got into it and started just buying stuff and just whatever, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to restart that series, Oaklands VR, and have an entire series where I start from scratch and play in VR, the whole thing. Okay, so I'm not seeing anything at all. No spookwood trees, no things hanging out the top, out the sides. I really want to go up the mountain and check, but I know that my time is limited tonight, so I need to just go and find a spookwood tree. You know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. <clears throat> Zoink. Grab this. Come on. Come on. And first things first, because you know we're going to need one. Let's go grab some TNT. Yoink. In you go. Alright, let's get. Let's get going. Um, whoa. Oh, no permission. <laughs> so, um, I'm working on this thing at work right now. I can't go into too much details about what it is, but basically, I've got to. Um, take a CSV file from one of our business systems. Oh, didn't need TNT after all. Sweet. And uh, I've got to take the CSV that gets delivered to us on two types. There's a bulk run and then there's a delta sync. And uh, what a bulk run is, it's like the entirety of a database. So like, <sighs> see, we've got customer da data right? Or sales data or tax data, whatever, whatever the database holds, right? Our business system that we use, um, we actually export everything and try to import it into a local server of ours. And that's what I'm, I'm programming today. Well, for the last month I've been programming it. So I get lost in PowerShell scripting and, um, whole bunch of stuff so the PowerShell script that I've got running is on a Windows scheduler that will run at like 9 p.m. at night and what it will do it runs win SCP to dial into a SFTP server downloads an encrypted GPG file and then once it's locally on the uh, the server I use GPG decryption with a passphrase and a huge like private key public key hash it's crazy anyhow once it's decrypted and locally inside my uh, server I've written a PowerShell script that writes an SQL command that merges to uh, two of the columns for all the Delta syncs so what you do is basically the first one you take a huge bulk run and you create the database and then every day after that, you only get the change. What changed in that database? So that way I don't have to sit there and pull all that data every single day. It's good. It's good times. I, I'm having 
a lot of fun. I love programming. I love coding. Every time. Skills. Oh, no! 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 Look at that. See? See what happens? <laughs> oh, wait. Um... <laughs> Might be able to save it. Oh, passenger side. All right, let's do a rotate right. If we rotate it here, it'll go that direction and I might get stuck inside. But if I rotate it back here, less chance of getting stuck. Oh no, <laughs> that's horrible. Oh well, had fun. Uh oh. So whenever you hit the T and it flips you up on either your nose or your butt, make sure you rotate it at least once and then do a turn. You'll be on your side. Uh, did I lose my... Uh, oh, it's still up there. Okay. Let's go get my TNT that we didn't use or need. It's going to be awesome out of the back of the truck whenever I do the jump. Come on, spook trees. I've seen nothing so far. Whoa. Okay, zoom in. There we go. Come on. Whoa, 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 Get up there, get up there. Don't lose the momentum. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop. There we go. <laughs> Let's kick it under. That's fine. There we go. Okay. And off we go. <sighs> that took a second. All right, can we see anything from up here? Not up. Nothing. All right, keep going. I would love to like go down to the, uh, uh, like turn the corner and down here in the little thing, it's like got an elder spook tree. Oh, that'd be amazing. Have you guys seen the elders? You got your saplings, your your minis, your mid-range, your olders, and like the elder tree. There's names for each one. I only remember the elder because it's like so massive. They're the like the biggest trees you'll see. Well, not the biggest, but crazy, crazy looking. All right, here we go. Oh no! <laughs> that is not what I wanted to do. Dang it. All right, jump out. Let's go grab our TNT. Drop it out there. Let's go. It's gonna fall out again? Yeah. Grab it again. Put it back in the truck. And here we go. Hit the wall. Just once. You have to hit the wall to turn around. That's, it's like a requirement. <clears throat> but no, um, my programming the, the stuff that I'm doing is super complicated and it hurts my brain a lot. And it's like the one thing that I've been unsure of for a really long time. This particular program. I'm, I'm a good programmer. I'm not a good database administrator at all. I truncate tables just like without even asking people's permission. <laughs> just whole table. Gone. Delete a table. What happened? I deleted it. And there is no control Z. Like there's there is no undo button. You gotta back stuff up. If you don't back stuff up, you're you're done. You're done for. So we keep most of the stuff on the F drive. So as long as I back the F up, we're good. So <clears throat> public drives. Um so if you work for a corporation that has a good networking team, good infrastructure and stuff like that. You should have an Active Directory, um, a public server with f public folders, an intranet, and then um, what else? A couple of things like that. Phone systems. If you guys have ever messed with uh, Yada, oh, Yealink, sorry, not Yada, Yealink. I got GoTo, which works with the uh, Yealinks. <coughs> Just set that up today. Anyhow, a lot of people, um, actually, one of your comments, uh, somebody said you were reading my book. 
and you asked, can I ever become as good as a coder as you? Yes, absolutely. Like, don't for a second think that just because I'm, I know more programming than you, did I just lose my team? Oh, wait, let's, oh, oh, go get the TNT. Oh, it was like right on the edge. Oh. Please let the lag slow down the boulders. Well, actually, I'm not, I'm not seeing a boulder, so. Broken volcano? Possibly. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Go around. Go around! Mm. <laughs> oh, no. No, no, no. Get up there. Get up there. Go, 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 go. Okay. There we go. Go, 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 go. I completely forgot. If you slow down, you can get stuck on these little edges. I completely forgot about that. All right. Head down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now, so one of you said to um, use a long plank to get up here so I don't have to risk the boulders. You can if you want, but I mean, that's why I do this. I, I get the skills to travel along this stuff. Hmm. Oh, I thought that was a door for a second. This little part right here, I thought that was a shadow and it was a door. I'm like, how have I never seen that door there before? Okay. I'm going down forwards, which is a bad idea. Oh, oh. You should never go down forwards. Always go down backwards. Otherwise, you end up like this. All right, when I turn this, I should drop straight down. Except the TNT is going to kill me, dude. TNT is going to kill me. I'm going to rage quit lumber just because my TNT keeps falling out. Get out from underneath the car, please. Go left, go left, go left. Oof. Whoa. Oh, I'm not going to be able to. Jump, jump. Dang it. Maybe I can just grab it. Maybe. Can I grab? Can I grab? Can I grab? Can I grab? Grab, rotate. Hey, we got it. Skills. Um, two, boom, turn. Oh, I forgot. I've got to be. Oh, no. Oh no. <laughs> Am I stuck in the truck now? Oh gosh. Open the trunk. <laughs> Just walk it out. Walk it out. It's fine. Alright, I gotta be in the driver's seat. Right here. Uh, oh, first I need my blueprint out, and then I can be in the driver's seat. There we go. Now we can do a turn. Turn. Boom. It's amazing how much you gotta do just to correct a mistake with your car. <sighs> kind of wish there was an auto flip button. Oh, uh, no bridge. Hmm. Okay, that's strangely odd. Was there a bridge whenever I came up here? Hold on. Get off the wall, dude. There we go. And it's nighttime, so I can't even see anything anymore. Shrink. There we go. <laughs> Looks like that video I posted. <laughs> I uh, I posted a comment, or no, I posted a tweet, tweet, tweet. I tweeted, I twittered. I'm um, tweet, tweet, tweeter burst. I xed, xed. I don't know. They call it X now. But anyhow, I posted a thing on Twitter. Oh, come on. Get out of there. And it was a, it was a monster truck doing uh, flips off of a thing. Anyhow, it was really cool. I thought you guys would like it. I wrote, uh, must have trained in lumber. Because of the way his truck was flipping around and stuff. It's pretty cool. Oh, okay. 
not stuck again. Okay. Woo! What a frustrating night. Okay, this has been very frustrating. I'm just saying. Normally it doesn't take me this long to traverse the uh, volcano. And go searching. Oh, I forgot to shut the trunk. Dang it. No spook, no spook, no spook. No spook. I think we need to go to another server. Just saying. Make one run through here. Has anybody ever found a spook tree inside this tunnel? Because I, I don't know that they can spawn inside here. Alright. And better question. Seeing as I can see that this gold tree is sticking out of the wall, which means it was growing on this piece of land, does that mean spook trees can be stuck in walls as well? The swamp always freaks me out. Just a little bit. <gasps> no way! No way! <gasps> Wait a second. The rock's gone. What the heck? And I lost my TNT. I don't know where I lost it at. I don't care. Look at this. Look at this. Wait, is that another one? There's no way that's another one. Okay, that's just a gold tree. Gold. Gold. Oh my gosh. Dude, this is going to get so many views just because of the... Wait, is that another one? No, it's not. That's gold. It's going to get so many views just because it's next to the hole. Oh, dude. The thumbnail is going to look... Well, cool. I got my video. <laughs> got my spook tree video. It's not an elder, but it is an older one. Very nice. Good find. And do not fall down the hole. Oh, I love it. Ugh. Almost don't even want to cut it down. It's like so pretty. been so mad if I looked over and it wasn't recording. Now hold on. It had black particles there for a second. And now they're orange. Oh, taking forever. So I'm sitting here thinking and wondering why was the lag so bad inside the um, volcano? And why did everything bunch up there at the end? And better yet, why were the rocks destroyed over at the uh, the fall, the towards the winter biome? And then I get over here to the swamp and the rock is missing? I think there might be something wrong with this particular server. Spookwood! Spookwood! <laughs> Oh gosh, that is heavy. Turn it around. All right, lay, lay it down like that. That's... Whew, okay. We're going to have to park this thing and... All right. There we go. Do your best, Code. And rock it up on the end. Rock it up, rock it up. There you go. All right. 
and I'll just kind of balance it across. <coughs> All right, it's on. Oh, <laughs> beautiful. Oh my gosh, that is a huge tree. I am excited. I am super excited. Let's go. Let's go. Are we going back this way? Yeah, we're going to have to go back this way, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's fine. Should I go grab my TNT? Yeah, let's do that. Spookwood! <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Jumping off the spookwood tree as I jump out of the car, as it's traveling. Man, skills. Mad skills. Not applicable to, like, any real-world job. <laughs> well, I mean programming and applications. So, Roblox. Oh, stop it. You stop that. Get back in. Is that Blue's Clues? Sounds like Blue's Clues. Oh, no. Um... Why is it? Okay, you know what? Get in the car. <clears throat> we had a better grasp on it on the ground. So whenever I hit this rock right here, it uh, wouldn't move anymore. Strange. So rock it up, spin it around, and then slowly but surely into the car. Or not. Or here, you know what? We'll just pivot. We'll pivot all around this thing. I can lift you up like this. Oh. Pivot to one side. Oh, actually. Oh. Okay, that kind of works. So, um... Whenever you hold shift, you can like rotate and stuff, right? If uh, you move forward and the object that you have is too heavy, you'll start to drop it. But then if you hold shift and you use Q and E, you can kind of like wiggle them back and forth. Oh, I can press E at the same time on that. That's crazy. <coughs> hold on, I got it backwards, upside down. My bad. Hold on, I need to, okay, this needs to actually rock this direction. And then I can rock it up this direction. <laughs> it's like wiggling its little butt. Wiggle, 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 scooch, scooch, scooch. That is a heavy tree, just saying. Nice and gentle. Home we go. I got my spook tree. I got my spook tree. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm ready for VR. I'm ready for some Oaklands. Because that's next. I'm going to go play some Oaklands VR. I'm going to start that off right. All right. This. <laughs> hmm. 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 Ba, ba, da, ba, ba. Who is it? Is that Dog Guru or something? I don't remember what his name is. It's a meme. Wee! First, I almost thought I was about to do a backflip. That would have been awesome if I had pulled off an actual backflip. Um, has anybody ever done a true backflip in these cars? Like, I've dropped them from great heights, and they always seem to, like, try and rescind themselves. I've done a backflip with a car. TNT will do a backflip to a car. <laughs> I'm like, wait a second. I have done that before. All right, this is too close. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Nice. 
Forward, forward. Scooch, scooch. Forward, forward. Scooch, scooch. Ooh, I dropped it. Oh gosh, please. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. No, we're not, no, we're not. Get in there. God, it's heavy. It's a heavy tree. That is, that is a big tree. Big tree, sir. Drive it right through front of a uh, Woods R Us so everybody can see that I got the spook wood tree. See it? See it, Tom? You'll love it. Let's drive it over here to this person. Look. Look what I found. Lucky, lucky. Look at cold. Hi. Oh. Okay. Let's head over this direction. Uh, we're going to have to plank this. Otherwise, um... Oh, I've already got a thing to plank over here. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay. So if I drop these right here, that should give me enough to work with. Uh, that should go in. That should work. Basically what I'm doing is I'm sectioning this all off into parts that should make at least one unit. One by one unit, I mean. Oops. I'm still hitting the wrong spot. There you go. Well, not quite. Oh, I'm going to have to go take my boulder out, aren't I? Come here, buddy. Let's put you at the end. You were, you were fun. There we go. Clink. Hold up. Hold up. It's not one by ones, right? Oh. I'm about to do some long planking. That's not what I need. I need spook woods. Three by two point eights. Or 2.6? I guess we can't do 2.8. Zoink! That's a lot of wire. <laughs> that wire was dropped off by somebody. Was it Fezzik? I don't remember who dropped it off. Thank you to the person that went in, out of their way and purchased all of that stuff for me. I really do appreciate it. Which, by the way, can you tell that I've not finished it with all the wires? <laughs> oh gosh, is this thing not going to plank? Oh, please let it plank. Hold on. Do I have doors? I do have doors. Basic door. All right, turn, turn, rotate. That's the back end, hold on. So do you see the design here? Oh, actually, wait. Actually, yeah, okay. So when it's on the ground, it, it's fine because it's directly centered. But once you put it up here, it picks like a dominant side. See that? So the bounding box that the model's fitting in, um, that's how it attaches to door bridges. So turn. Oh, oh, I think that's it. I think that's it. That might not be it. Oh, is this a long plank? It is a long plank. I need a little bit of this, please. Thank you. Let's go fill you in. Okay. There you go. Shot. All right, let's try again. 
That might be too close to the edge. <coughs> oh, how am I going to open that? Oh, I guess right there. Yeah, it's too far away or too close. One of those two. So let's go, let's back off. What, like one? Let's try right there. Open door. So the door is currently currently closed. Hold up. Is it clipping? It is. It's like what the Okay. Ah, there it goes. Okay. That kind of worked. I'm going to be super mad if I can't keep this tree. Please. Please. <laughs> Is anyone able to sawmill wood? I seem to be experiencing lots of lag. I'm gonna be so mad. Maybe it's not enough for a unit? Um, don't know if that's the case. Let's, uh, let's try a bigger. Bigger log here. <sighs> there we go. In you go. We're at 32 minutes. <gasps> Yay! Okay, it might have just not been big enough to uh, sawmill. It's not going fast enough, just saying. Come on, dude. Just chop already, thank you. Jeez. Just thought of something. One by ones. Those should be able to change to one by one, right? I think. Maybe. Possibly. Who knows? I could be way off. Way off. <clears throat> oh, go on. Get in there, buddy. There you go. Hey, there we go. We've got we've got little little ones now hashtag save the spook save all parts of the spook tree that's what we know 
Also, if you don't have the power to build, or if you've not purchased the game pass for the power to build, um, I do have tutorials on how to, like, reserve your wood. Like, what to do when you're building with certain objects. How to get the most out of your spook wood. Because here's the thing. Spook wood, I know that there's a lot of it uh, as far as people... Um, on their base and stuff, but it, it like getting the the wood yourself and oh gosh, that is not. I wonder if that's too big. You know what? You guys don't need to sit here and watch me hack away at this thing. So, thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon Two with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate, where we found a spook wood. Yeah. So keep, keep hunting, keep looking. I want to see pictures in my Discord. Send them to me on Twitter. Like, I, I want to see your guys' exploration. How many did you get? How many have you found? Just all of that. I love it. Love this time. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things. I'm supposed to call out at the end of videos like a good YouTuber does, but it's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. You were here, you watched, you had fun, and I love you for that. I love you for being you. I love you for just being able to sit here and exist at the same time that I am. Like, seriously, like, if you think about it on a deep intellectual level, right, I happen to be existing in 2023, the same time that you're existing, which I could be part of history, or I could be something in the future, like, it's just, that's amazing. Thank you. Thank you for being here, and thank the world for being here. Love you guys. Outro. Oh, I didn't do the thing. Outro.